Hi, it's John Costa Mesa R&D. Well, today we have a little Fiat 1200 cylinder head on the bench here. And we're going to do a valve job and resurface this head. And we're going to take you through the steps of how that's done. Looking at this pretty quickly, we can see the exhaust valves look pretty good so far. However, we do have a problem here with this intake valve where the rocker arm has actually cupped the top of the valve stem. So we're going to have to take a look at the rocker arms. And this one here has been beat up pretty good too. So far, it doesn't look too awfully bad. I'm sure this has had at least one valve job before. And now we're going to give it another one this time. We're going to take the spring seats and the retainers over to the uh, little tumbler. We've already dumped the springs in there and we'll clean these up. Well, now that we got the valve cleaned up, we'll go ahead and cut these stem ends. Looks good. This is the one that's really bad. Well, now that we have the stem ends all ground, we can go ahead and replace the valve. I'll grab a little bit more and take it off here. Now that looks about better. Well, we got the springs out, out of the uh, tumbler, and they turned out really nice, really nice and clean. And then the retainers and the spring seats, everything came, everything came out real nice. So now what we have to do is uh, get this head cleaned up, probably put it in the thermal cleaner, and then we'll start on the valve job. Well, we're getting ready to clean the little Fiat head. And just wanted to show you what that looks like before, and then we're going to show you some after shots here. We'll put this in at about 450 degrees for about 45 minutes. Well, here we are after the blast. You can see the head's cleaned up really well. Port's 
are looking good. It looks like we've got a little bit of corrosion right here. But that shouldn't be any big deal for this. And now it's off to the tumbler. Well now we're ready to do the seats. And we're cutting all three angles at one time. do it. Well I have the head set up here on the mill and we're going to mill this thing flat and then we'll put it together. Well as you can see it's not cleaned up here in the middle so the head is pretty warped. Well, we've taken about 10 thousandths total off this head and we cleaned up pretty good. So our next uh, operation is to clean the head up before we assemble it. Well, we put everything back together and this little head's ready to go. That's a real nice surface finish on the deck. Ports are all nice and clean. Head's nice and clean. And that's ready to go. If you have questions about cylinder head rebuilding, give me a call here at Coast Base R&D. We'll see you soon.